thing's not looking too hot. It's been out here 15 months in anchor. It's uh, definitely taking on some water or the... Oh, there's the bottom right there. It must be sitting on the keel. Alright, well we just pulled into Boston Harbor. We're gonna pick up uh, my girlfriend patient. We're gonna head over to the island and set up the camp. Hey, you made it! Alright, let's get out of here. Alrighty, let's go. Bad, eh? We already put a big dent in the Oreos and we haven't even got our beds set up. Like they're almost gone by the time we boated here. Mm -hmm. The tent's set up and we're munching. Get the whole camp set up and uh, Ocean Man showed up. And now we're gonna go do some exploring on the skiffs. Right, mate. Fucking right, we got uh, 25 horse smoke, fucking like two horse fucking like DLT. 2.5. 8690 on the depth sander. Pretty fucking awesome, mate. Alright, we got a boatload of people. This dog. Shipwreck. Dude, look at the mast is sheared off. I think Eddie's not here trying to take it. Oh. <laughs> 
bolts are so loose that when this comes off, it's gonna sink it. Okay, let's let this thing flip over. If it starts to tip, I'm just gonna spart and dive into the water. He's always Got some uh, maple honey spam cooking up. Sand. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting here enjoying the beach. Got some uh, Colombian roast via with some honey in it. It's not too bad. Yeah, Pitch just doesn't like it though. It's the worst thing she thinks it's too bitter. <laughs> it's not too bad. Right, well we had coffee on the beach with Ocean and Mina. Now we're gonna have some breakfast over at the Mullins. Little delicious breakfast cooked up. type of boat uh, I grew up fishing on in Alaska. Not exactly like it, but the same uh, sort of setup, you know? This looks like a retired saner turned to a gooey duck boat. We're aboard the mollusk and back at it. Got the skiff right there with all the camping gear in it. Heading to a new little spot. All right, well, we hitched a ride on the mollusk, and now we're heading into our next camping site. It's right up here on the beach. There's a beautiful little spit that, if it's a low enough tide, you can camp on it without getting wet. So that's what we're going to go do. We're barely in gear and we're hauling on.
<laughs> Hoodie and the two water bottles in the back. This is a gorgeous beach, a great spot to stay. I'm super excited. So is this guy playing with his ball. You excited, Wessie? Right around here. Yeah. Well, got the tent all set up. GoPro was supposed to be recording, but it wasn't, so missed that, but. Yeah, I want all my camp gear and clothes to smell like fire when I get home. I want my hair to smell like fire. And then... Not bad, huh? All right, got camp set up, and now we're gonna ride the tide in up Fish Trap all the way up to Ocean's dad's house. Go hang out, maybe grab some firewood from him and see what happens. Super beautiful up here. Right, y'all see that? Those are all sand dollars underwater. Looks pretty good. Yep. This trail is always the coolest at night because they have these string lights that run down the side and it's like a magical fairy trail or something. It's awesome. What? You say I'm I am magical like a fairy tale? <laughs> no, I said the trail is magical like a fairy tale. At night when the lights are shining. Nobody <laughs> answers. We're there. Drake. Welcome to uh, Tommy Drake's Cantina. Did I didn't throw out? I didn't know what they were. Hey, <laughs> hey. <laughs> Got him. I'm going to, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably have a lot too, because there was... Really. What did you do with that cooler with all that beer in? That big cooler? It's right, 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 right over there. Firewood.
stick? Where's your stick? Huh? Where's your stick? Where's your stick? Huh, do you want to play with this stick? Um, get it. Oh, get it. You ready? Very nice. Plenty of wood. Right on that. Right on. More too. This little camp stool doesn't work great in the sand. It starts sinking in. Pretty soft sand. Come here, Wes. Come here. Come here. And there it comes. There's Eddie doing the power call. <laughs> But it somehow somehow it got it. the flavor, yeah. Well, maybe I did. Maybe after I maybe I saved it after I cooled down, you know. All right, we made some uh, cheesy bacon hash browns with tapatio and ketchup. Sounds like a pretty good meal. Yeah, not bad, huh? All you need is eggs now, and you'd be at people just like at the at uh, at hash Martin Way, Martin Way mm -hmm. Diner. Oh, true, true. <laughs> Do you ever have you been there? Well, had a great day. Got camp all set up here and uh, cooked some uh, delicious dinner and had some good times. And then I'm going to pass off the night and uh, see you guys in the morning. Hopefully the tide or uh, cougars don't get me. We'll see. Good morning, everybody. It's like uh, 6.41 in the morning. <laughs> He's converted into a house. He's like still in the process of building it, but that's awesome. He lives in like an apartment that's attached to it. All right, well, I'm gonna leave camp and buzz down around the corner to uh, Zittles and get some fuel for the skiff and maybe a few snacks and a drink or two, and we'll be fun.
I may have forgot it was Easter, so everything is it'll shut down unfortunately. So no fuel, no snacks. So we're running a little bit low, but we have enough to make it back to the campsite and then back to Olympia. So probably get some fuel tomorrow or you know, just be careful with it. But I guess we'll head back now. Alright, well I think I'm gonna break camp and head back towards Olympia. Nowhere sells fuel right now. I'm running super low on fuel for the outboard. So I uh, think I'm gonna call it. Run low on water too, so pack everything up, head back, and um, see what happens. Maybe come back out tomorrow or whatnot, but. All right, well, that's the last of it. Here's the campsite, left a firewood there for Eddie tonight because he's going to come back and have a fire. So This was my favorite spot yet. Trash. Water. Backpack will go back here with me. Let's push. Off we go. Tide so far out. Got her in shoal trim. Pretty shallow and uh, that's going up. And we're back to the marina. Back here at uh, my sailboat, Dos Amigos. All right, everybody. Well, that's where we're going to end this one. Appreciate everybody following along and watching. If you would like to support the channel, go ahead and check out my Amazon wish list down below in the description. Anything bought off there goes straight towards helping the channel. It'd be super awesome. And that's always appreciated. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys out there next time.